Hello, today I'm going to show you how to assemble your scientific method foldable. It is a PDF and I have opened it in preview on my Mac because Adobe Acrobat Pro does not have a prompt box for printing double-sided. Now, my printer prints double-sided on its own. I don't have to take the paper out and flip it. If yours doesn't print on its own, then you don't have to worry about it. But if it does have double-sided printed, double-sided printing, you want to make sure that when you print it, wrong button, when you print it, it has a long edge binding. If you do short edge binding, it's not going to work. So you want to flip on the long edge, okay? So once you've printed it, what you're going to do is you're basically going to line up your pages. So I choose to line up six, seven, sorry, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, and when you download yours, it won't be uneven like that. It'll be even. Okay, then you're just going to flip the top over until your step three lines up with your step four. Now, I already folded this, so it is a little uneven, but that's just because I folded it with one hand. Once you have it folded, you're just going to take a stapler and you're just gonna staple three staples in the top. Now the higher you get to the top, the more room you're gonna have for folding. If you staple down here, you're not gonna have as much room underneath your first step. Okay, so I'm just gonna staple right there. And then I like to do one in the middle as well. well that one's a little wonky, but that's okay. So then I like to go through and I just like to flip up the edges so that they'll fold a little easier when the time comes. And then if you want to put this in an interactive notebook, all you have to do is put four dots of glue right on the back, one, two, three, four, a fifth one in the middle, and then glue it down into your notebook. Thank you so much for purchasing. I appreciate it.